It's going to be a video on how to change the belt and uh, do some general maintenance and cleaning on the Senkyo 2008 projector. Uh, first, some of the tools you'll need is a Phillips screwdriver, a um, this is a pipe cleaner from a dollar store. Uh, this is a dental instrument or a wire hook or maybe a piece of a coat hanger or something like that. Um, nail polish remover and alcohol. I also have a syringe filled with a, uh, a high grade machine oil. Uh, syringes are a little hard to get these days so if you don't have that or have access to one you can use one of the um, ink refill kits. They come with a syringe, it just doesn't have a pointed tip on it and that'll work just as well for what we're going to do with it and also a uh, new belt. So to start with to change the belt just take the front cover off take the lamp out Now I'm going to move in behind the lamp here, and you see this aluminum cover. There's a screw down here, and I'm going to move this little wire out of the way. And there's a Phillips screw up here, and this little uh, wire holder is also up underneath that screw. So you're going to need to remove that cover. So there's a little cover. Set the screws aside. Now you can actually see the belt right here on the uh, on the up top pulley. Now we need to switch around to the back. And take the back off, just two Phillips screws. I already had these loose, so okay. Now you see, I got a little bit of black here from the from the old belt that uh, kind of turned to goo. That's where the nail polish remover comes in. You can use that to clean. Well, you're going to need to clean all the goo out of the uh, off the pulleys there. I got a little bit left over, but uh, I'm not going to mess with it right now. But if you had a bunch of it, uh, you need to clean it all out of the projector and. Uh, be careful with it because it will stain anything it gets on. And I've already changed the belt on this one, so I'm just going to go ahead and cut this one out. Remove it. And start putting the belt back on. Start over the little uh, fan, blower fan. Just work it around it. The belt will stretch. You don't have to worry about damaging it. And once you get it on and around, pull it there. Don't necessarily put it back in the groove where it goes. Go behind it onto the motor shaft. It's going to give you a little extra play on the next step here. So what you need to do now is turn the projector around. And now you can kind of look down in there and you, you can see the belt way down there. So now it's when your little metal hook comes into play. You need to reach down and grab it and pull it to the front. And just kind of see I've got it pulled up and I'm on the bottom of the pulley here. I'm gonna use my thumb just kind of rotate the pulley. It's a little difficult. It doesn't always want to go there. Now let's turn it around. You can see it kind of jumped up right where it's not supposed to be. So let's bring it back here and there we go. Now we're good. New belt. Now all you gotta do is put your front cover back on. But um, before you put the back cover back on, there's a couple things you can do, especially with the motor. It's going to be, let me see if it, let's see a little bit better here on the bottom. It's probably a little hard for you to see. Let me get my oil. Right here is a little foam pad, and you just need to put a few drops of oil in the front and down here on the bottom. Sometimes they're a little hard to get to. You can't see it on the bottom. That one might be easier to get to from the top. 
Yeah. That's a little hard to see in a video, but you'll find it a little right back in there to do that pad. And uh, that's really about all the cleaning and stuff you could if you have some lithium grease. Put it back over here uh, on the uh, in front of the shutter. Um, you'll see where and it's back in there. It's hard to see, but there's a there's a flat place on it to put a little bit of a uh, put a little bit of lithium if you have it. If not, no big deal. On the front, in terms of cleaning or anything, you can uh, pull the focus knob out, slide your lens out, clean your back side of your lens, clean the front of your lens. Then you can pull the gate forward, which will open up down in the gate here. And that's where I use my uh, pipe cleaner I got from the dollar store. That's probably not the ideal thing, but it's readily available. I usually put a little bit of alcohol on it too and run it through the gate and a few times and then make sure you switch uh, from super 8 to regular 8 and back and forth so you can clean both of the ap apertures uh, you close that back you can also take this cover off here on the loading and clean your roller and this area up here and the lower film path, there's a little spring back here, you pull it back, and this pops off the lower. And this is your lower film path. And again, I just take a uh, little alcohol on a pipe cleaner and just follow the entire film path out just to clean it. Make sure there's nothing left up in there. And next thing left to do is just put it back together in the... Uh, reverse order, put your metal cover on, put your lamp back in, put your back cover on and enjoy a movie. Hope this helps you.